Piers Morgan scolded by guest for wrongly using term, woke, as he's told, you know better, the talk TV host was speaking about actor Alan Cumming handing back his obe given to him in 2009 as he cited the toxicity of the British Empire. On Wednesday night's installment of Piers Morgan Uncensored, the talk TV star was discussing Alan's decision to give back the royal honour after his eyes were opened over how the British Empire profited at the expense of indigenous people. During the discussion, he welcomed guests Nigel Bigger and Bonnie Greer to get their thoughts. During their discussion, viewers learnt Nigel had his book on colonialism cancelled in 2021 by the publisher Bloomsbury. Curious as to why the decision was made, the guest revealed a group of woke junior employees had complained. Telling peers the group protested against anything they didn't agree with, people above them in senior management agreed to their demands. However, the talk TV host was left less than impressed as he went on a rant on the issue of wokeism. Peers slammed. That is the problem isn't it in this culture, you've got these very young woke employees who buy into all these narratives. Then they think it's completely right to work for a publisher, supposedly supporting free speech in a democratic society like Britain and they think it's fine to actually try and get that author cancelled because they don't agree with some of the stuff you've written. Listening to how Piers was using the term, Bonnie Greer chimed in to slam him for using the word, woke, wrong. She commented, can I just say something, woke, I'm so unhappy about that name being taken over. We, Nigel Bigger, were talking about history, woke was a signal to people escaping from slavery. They used the word on the Underground Railroad that was one of the signals to let them know they were in a safe house. Interjecting, Piers told viewers the word began in the 60s within the black music community in America. He said, it was established as a way of expressing a bigger awareness of social and racial injustice, I completely sign up to that, by that definition and woke. What's happened to the word? It's been hijacked by people who are now behaving like fascists. As Bonnie tried to argue her point, she told the presenter as he was aware of the history of the word, he should use it correctly. She slammed. Because you know that, you shouldn't use it the way you use it, because you know that. You shouldn't do it, you know better. Elsewhere in the interview, Piers commented people who use the term are wearing it as a badge of honor. He continued. I think it's become a band of the new fascism, it's basically people now embrace the word woke themselves and say, I'm so woke that if you say anything I don't like, I'm going to ruin, shame vilify and cancel you. Bonnie told Piers he has the power to inform people about where the word came from as he told his guest he's written a whole book about it. She added, then you shouldn't use it. You shouldn't use it that way.